Yeah. The extent of my energy experience has to be with uh, Jack 3D and Hyde when I mix them both together. Whether you're watching this on YouTube or Instagram, everybody wants to talk shit when the spotter spots with his hands on the bar. Everyone's like, let's see you do a real competition. But yet, when you go to a competition, the spotter has to walk 10 to 20 feet away. So if you got five, six, seven hundred pounds on you, if you don't get it, essentially the first two seconds, you're fucked for someone comes to help you anyways. So what's the difference if he turns around and gives his back to me? Because that's what you guys, keyboard warriors, say you want to see anyways. I don't want to see a spot. I mean, I only hit one with my over with 633. I'm just saying. I want to see you take it off with no lift off. I want to see no hands on the bar. But when I give it to you, you talk shit. That's dangerous. You might hurt yourself. I'm not worried about none of that. I'm just going to lift. He's got big biceps. He likes to show them off. He's good for the camera. Just, just sit back and enjoy what you're seeing. The thing is, it's a weird setup because here, at least there's enough quantity of people to come and like, give you a spot. Yeah. that helps get that lactic acid out and the finding out where your range of mobility is before you later on in the workout get under the bar. 